Former President Donald Trump campaigning in Battleground, Michigan, is hoping to court black voters, speaking at a roundtable discussion at a church in Detroit. We've done more for, and I say this, I say it proudly, more for the black population than any president since Abraham Lincoln. That's a big statement. Ahead of the event, his campaign unveiled the Black Americans for Trump coalition. Trump and President Biden are running neck and neck in the polls in Michigan, a key swing state that President Biden won in 2020 by around a 3 percent margin. Michigan voters say the economy is top of mind. The economy is a big issue for people who are barely making it, eggs, milk, bread, everything's really high, so that is a big ticket issue. Later, Trump will headline a convention held by a conservative youth group. A roster of Trump allies took the podium, including convicted former chief strategist Steve Bannon, who slammed the Department of Justice. In Los Angeles, President Biden arrived for a star-studded fundraiser this evening with former President Barack Obama and actors George Clooney and Julia Roberts. The Biden campaign says the event has already raised at least $28 million, calling it a record for a single Democratic fundraiser. Before joining the president, First Lady Jill Biden campaigned in the battleground state of Arizona. Donald Trump is dangerous. Yes, to our livelihood, to our security, and to the future of our country. We simply cannot let him win. In 12 days, former President Trump and President Biden are scheduled to face off in their first 2024 debate. Natalie Brand, CBS News, the White House.